Hello fellow adventurers and welcome back to my channel. For those of you new here, hi, my name is Erica and today's video is a troop announcement video. So as you can probably see in the title, guess where I'm going? Da, 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 da. Disney World! And I am really psyched about this trip. Now I go to Disney World at least once a year, but this trip is gonna be very, very different. I'm doing some things I've never done before. It's also a girls trip, so I'm really looking forward to that. I'm staying at a hotel I've never stayed at before, so there's a lot we gotta chat about. So without further ado, let's dive into the video. All right, so just to start things off, this trip, we're gonna be in Disney World for three full days. We're gonna do two full park days, and then half a park day. You'll see what I mean. So the two full park days that we're doing is Epcot and Animal Kingdom. And I'm very excited because I'm gonna be staying on Disney property, which I haven't done in a while. Um, I've been staying off property, which there's pros and cons to both, but I'm so excited to be staying back on property. And I'm staying at the Pop Century Resort, which I've never stayed at before. And I'm so excited and looking forward to it because I hear that resort is awesome. And also it's on the Skyliner. So you get to ride the Skyliner over to Epcot and Hollywood Studios. And I'm just so excited to utilize the Skyliner. I have been on the Skyliner before, just like a little afternoon at Disney World, just kind of bopping around the resorts there, but I've never stayed at a resort on the Skyliner. So I'm really psyched to like see how that looks and how awesome the Skyliner is gonna be as a means of transportation. Now we're doing Epcot, which I'm very excited about because there'll be food and wine festival, which I've been to before, but there's always new food booths every year, new snacks to try. And then Animal Kingdom, just love that park. So we're doing that park, but our half day park is what we're doing. I'm so excited about this. We are going to Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. And this is something that has been on my bucket list ever since I even knew what the Halloween party was. So if you're watching, you're like, Erica, I have no idea what you're talking about. Do not worry, I will explain. So Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party is basically a Halloween party at the Magic Kingdom. It is a separate ticket event, so you need to get a separate ticket in order to attend. They sell a limited number of tickets, so it's a little bit smaller of a crowd there, you know, than a typical full blown out Magic Kingdom Bay ticket sold out. It's, it's a little bit smaller than that. It runs from, I think it's 7 p.m. to midnight, but you can get into the park at 4 p.m. And it is just like Halloween everywhere. You can dress up in costume, you can trick or treat throughout the Magic Kingdom and they're gonna give you all this candy to enjoy. You, There are also um, parades, special fireworks shows, special like shows in general with the Hocus Pocus crew and just all the Halloween characters. There are special characters walking around so you can meet some special characters that you never see in the parks. Um, also there are ride overlays which they kind of like Halloweenify some rides in the Magic Kingdom. Like there's just so much going on and I've heard so many good things about this party. And it's a big reason like why we're just doing this trip in general because me and my friends were like, we've always wanted to do it. Like let's do it this year. Now we are going in August. So you're probably thinking that's a little odd because it's not even fall time and it's not really Halloween season. But this party starts in August and runs through Halloween. So we're gonna be at one of the very first parties. So I will show you everything that goes down at the party so that way you can make a decision if you'd like to do the party maybe this year this year or sometime in the future but yeah i am like the halloween party that is going to be the number one highlight of this trip speaking of the halloween party so if you didn't notice i did mention that you can dress up in costume because it's halloween trick-or-treating right so i want you guys to comment down below i'm not going to tell you you're gonna have to wait and see what character I'm going as. And it's me and a group of girls, so we're doing like a group theme. So try and guess maybe what we're gonna be dressing up as in the comments. And be sure to follow me on Instagram so you can be the first one to see what my costume is. I'm so excited about it because I ordered it from Amazon, the pieces here and there, and I think it's gonna turn out real good. I'm really psyched about it. So let me know down in the comments what you think I'm going as for the Halloween party. Now, some other things we're doing on this trip is a day at Disney Springs. We're eating at Homecoming, one of my favorite restaurants in Disney Springs. It's like Southern comfort food. It's amazing. We're gonna be doing Disney Springs. Um, exploring some resorts. I hope that we get to visit um, Port Orleans Riverside. We're planning on visiting that. Pla planning on visiting a lot of the Skyliner resorts. Because we're staying on the Skyliner, we can just hop on the Skyliner and like visit more resorts. Um, and just a pro tip, like if you're going to Walt Disney World for the first time, I highly, highly recommend checking out some of the resorts because they are just 
incredible, incredible detailing, incredible theming. And you might see a future resort that you want to stay at and you can kind of like go into the lobby, see the pool area, see what all that resort has to offer. So I definitely recommend that. We will be dining at um, the Grand Floridian Cafe as well. So there's just a lot going on on this trip. A lot of things I'm doing for the first time that I'm so, so excited about. And I will be having a video coming out next week that's a pack with me. But as a little treat for you guys right now, I do have a mini Disney haul from TJ Maxx to show you all because I went to TJ Maxx yesterday because I saw on TikTok that there's so much Disney stuff in that store right now. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to go there and check it out. And I came home with a couple goodies. So I want to show you guys what I got for the trip. So first thing, and this is actually like Disney branding, um, was a necklace. Now I do have a Disney necklace, but it's gold and I want silver because I like to have my gold like jewelry match and then my silver jewelry match. Yeah, I'm one of those girls. Okay, so I saw this necklace and I already took it out of the box because it's so cute, but it's like a little Mickey and Minnie and it's called Made for Each Other. So I just thought that was really cute and I thought that could go with all of my silver jewelry that I already have that's Disney. And then the other thing I got, these are really cute. Um, it's Disney and Babble Bar, which they make the cutest um, things. And it's these little gold Mickey hoops. So they're going to go in like a hoop, but they're going to be Mickey shaped. And I thought that was such like a cute, subtle Disney. Like I love subtle Disney and I also like a little bit of loud Disney too, but I thought this was so precious. So I had to pick it up. So those are, just, those are the two things that I did get in my little mini pre-haul before my Disney trip. But yes, like I said, I will be having a big pack with me video that's going to show you tips on like... Uh, comfortable Disney outfits, especially in the Florida heat, because I'll be going in August. Um, you know, what's in my park bag, what I always pack for Disney trips. I'm kind of a maniac when it comes to packing, but I'll be sharing all of my packing tips and all my outfits except the costume um, that I'll be wearing on the trip, which I am so, so looking forward to. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please, please give it a big thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on the pack with me and the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween video that I will be making for you all. So I will see you guys in the Pack With Me video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. You cut me loose and set me free. You make me